today's morning coffee vinyl side. Terry Gilkison and the Easy Riders, Remember the Alamo, 1961. The original Easy Riders folk group was comprised of Terry Gilkison, Rich Dare, and Frank Miller. Active from 1956 to 1959, they were part of the 50s folk boom that really peaked proper in and around 1958. Under the thumb and direction of Uber producer Mitch Miller, the Easy Riders represented the 50s establishment's last offensive to suppress both the youth voice in music, but specifically rock and roll. When the group disbanded in 59, Gilkison, the writer's principal voice and leader, turned his attention towards film and television, joining Disney, and started making music an endeavor that would eventually lead to an Oscar nomination in 1967 for The Jungle Book and the song The Bare Necessities. This project, seen here in a 1961 UK stereo pressing, appears to be a sanctioned, inspired by double dip on the popularity of the 1960 film The Alamo, the historically inaccurate but wildly popular John Wayne telling of the famed siege of the Alamo, which precipitated events that led to the formulation of the state of Texas. The original soundtrack for the film featured music by Dimitri Timokin and performances by other folkies like the Brothers Four. This album features a reconstitution of the Easy Riders, with Frank Miller most likely excluded, and covers of four of the songs from the film as well as quite a few inspired by folk styled songs that were imagined to be aesthetically correct to the region or period. And Gilkison's name is all over those songwriting credits, which to my mind paints this as a pure money grab. It's not in any way unpleasant, but it's not in any way necessary either. So not quite off-brand jeans, but definitely not Levi's. That's for sure.